good. I'm helping Holt pick a dating site. Oh, this looks good. PhDs only. Uh, actually, in this context, PhD stands for pretty huge Oh, my. I can only assume that MDs only stands for medium Okay, it's time to celebrate. You know what that means. This B needs a C in her A. Oh, my God. This babe needs a coconut in her arms. Oh, I thought you were saying this needs a in her Oh, my God. Yeah, that was my reaction. All right, I'll go get us a couple of coconuts. Sir, I'd like to talk to you about the new task force you're on the hiring committee for. The Special Tactical Operations and Auxiliary Strategic Response Citywide Emergency Investigative Unit for Emergency Operations. You know, I had a hand in naming it. And it's great, although you might want to try shortening it, maybe using a cool acronym. So the S-T-O-A-S-R-C-I-U-E-O. Hmm, you're right, that is cool. Sure. Before we get into your pitch, what are you calling the product? The Handless Lighting System, or HLS. Sounds like a genetic disorder. You're having a high-grade pre-test freakout? I've been there. March 13th, 2001, AP Calc test. Ames, I hate to cut you off, but we all know where this story's going. Oh, yeah? You know that I crapped my pants in the middle of the test? Oh, my God, no. I thought you were just going to say you got a B-plus or something. More like a BM. Noice. Hey, sport. You look a little D in the D. D for down and dumps, respectively. Probably easier to just not abbreviate if you have to explain it. Agree to D. Can we talk in the briefing room for a sec? There's a question I gotta ask you. Mm -hmm. It's happening. Jake is gonna pop the question. He's gonna ask me to be his BM. No. Uh -huh. BM, best man, is a common abbreviation. No one but you has ever used it. I've got you on tape, Kelly. You're screwed. The only thing that's gonna be on your desk in the morning is a list of my demands. Operation Triple Dragon is complete. You named it. Not only did I name it, Triple Dragon is an acronym. Two righteous individuals performing law enforcement directives rapidly against Gordon, our nemesis, Triple Dragon! This is the best thing that's ever happened! <laughs> I mean, not for you, obviously. It's bad for you. Hey, how'd it go with Kevin? Are you willing to admit everything's your fault? No, Amy, because none of this is my fault. Except for how you meddled in the captain's life today, possibly causing repercussions in his marriage that could last a lifetime. Yes, that is completely on me. But Amy, you didn't know that, so you were still wrong. You two need to go. You're not supposed to be here, and the captain's at a new level of anger. Constant smiling. It's horrible. All smiling is horrible. This is worse. We're here so I can activate the Holy Network of Administrative Assistants, acronym HINA. We high-level assistants keep track of what's going on with all the bosses. Jealous, Amy? Yeah, i tap that. That's too bad. I want all my brothers in the NYPD to do perfectly. The 7-4 is corrupt. You didn't hear it from me. You know what? We're just looking to eliminate waste. I assure you, you'll find zero waste here. Really? Because I did notice during my preliminary examination that you recently purchased a $21,000 copy machine. Well, that machine saves money in terms of man hours. Uh, if you excuse me, uh, Sergeant Wells, we need to go to the BRB. It's BRB time. We're BRB. -ing. Make space. You make space. This closet is for people who are freaking out. Oh, I'm fully freaking out. I just experimented with an unfamiliar acronym in public. BRB, what does it even mean? Be right back. It is the same number of syllables as the acronym. What's the point? Santiago, when I think of your comp stat reports, one word comes to mind, wow. And that wow is an acronym for wow, oh, wow. What is happening? He's buttering us up before giving us some devastatingly bad news. My god, Jake and Charles are dead. What do you want, Santiago? To learn the majestic art of self-defense from our cities, nay, our country. Come on, man, out with it. I want to start class. OK, I'm applying for a mentorship program for up-and-coming detectives. It's called Star Achieving Mentors, Star Achieving Mentees, or Sam Sam for short. Look, I know this is an inconvenience. However, I expect you all to be accommodating to our guests. Don't worry, sir. We will be cordial AF. As Frazier, love that show. Peralta, Special Agent Marks is here to make your transfer back to the NYPD official. And uh, on behalf of the Bureau, I wanted to personally thank you for your service. Bureau, it's FBI lingo for FBI. Yes, I've been a cop for 30 years, and I've seen movies. Roger that. You'll be uh, happy to know that the operation turned out to be one of the biggest RICO busts of all time. RICO stands for Racketeering Investigative Cop. Awesome. I have to ask, do you think awesome begins with an O? Yes. How'd it go? Good. They liked the thesis, and I was clear on the data. Just one problem. I realized halfway through that these sweatpants are from a bachelorette party I went to, and they say WAP. 
on the butt. I told them it stands for we all police. Extra ranch, no tomato, no cilantro. This is just a list of modifications on a signature salad from Panera. Okay, this one says, buy toilet paper in a truly gigantic font. I hate to think of the horrific event that led to a reminder of this size. Uh, this says your bank account number is 432-211-378. Then just under that, someone saw this and stole your money. Aw. Ugh, this just says, don't trust your D? Okay. Well, that's good advice. My D does get me in a lot of trouble. Wait, are you sure that's what the D stands for? Oh, it's for sure my dong. It could tell some stories. Costa Rica in 98. Nom. Yeah, it's coming up. I think you'd love Florida, Bob. I've never actually been there, but Pitbull's videos make it seem muy caliente. I know Figus, and you're in far more danger than I. He's coming for you. I guarantee you soldiers find this place. Not gonna happen. I rent it out under a shell corporation. Yeah. My mail goes to a P.O. Box in Queens. Yeah. My neighbors think my name is Emily Goldfinch. Oh, yeah. People I work with all think my name is Rosa Diaz. Yeah, wait, what? Don't worry about it. No, okay. Enough. I want to get this punk to talk. Oh, Bob. You are est in the B. They're gonna split us up and send us all the different precincts. This is the last time I'm gonna stand up here and look at you guys. He's got closer damn legs. No, this isn't over yet. Sure, maybe we don't have Strike Team Thunder Kill Alpha Cole and Hard Target, but we're the 9-9. We have Rosa and Charles, Gina, Amy and Terry and Carl. It's Mark. Sorry, I was just trying to include someone from outside the inner circle. There's an inner circle? The point is we're not rolling over. We're gonna solve a huge case before the hearing tonight. And then the NYPD cannot shut us down. So come on, Captain, give me something big and juicy. What do you got? A 10-year-old had his bike stolen. We are est in the B. I never realized I could have feelings this strong about a building. Okay, we just have to drop off our deposit and then we're done for the day. Well, it would appear that we have achieved what scholars refer to as the toitest of naps. Indeed. <laughs> Oh, hi, Susan. <laughs> We're normal people. Hi, I was just about to call you guys. Ah, well, no need to call because we are here and we've got our deposit. Thank you so much. We just booked all our vendors. It's really happening. Yeah, about that. Wait, what's wrong? Something's wrong. That's the look my mom gave me right before she told me that my dad left. Oh, God. Did my dad leave my mom again? How do you know my mom and dad? You know, I'm so sorry. There must have been a mix-up. Someone just contacted my manager and booked the venue before you got here. But we had an oral agreement. You said we had till the end of the day. EOD. It's not EOD. The D has an E. It won't be e would for H's. For you. And you. And you. What are these? These, madam, are STDs. What are you talking about, buddy? STDs. Save the dates for Vivian and my wedding. Ah, yes. Hey, just out of curiosity, how many people have you given STDs to? Lots. Like a hundred. <laughs> <laughs> What's going on? Uh, oh, okay, I get it. STD has another meaning. That. You're gross. No one else is gonna think that. Everyone is going to think that, but it's sweet that your mind didn't go there. Thank you. It is kind of sweet. Will your first dance be to You Give Me Fever? Will you be serving crabs at the reception? Do you have herpes? Guys, this is my wedding. This is important to me. No more jokes. You're right, and we're sorry. Yes. We love you, buddy. Warts and all. Sorry, I made a rash decision. I was itching to say it. Okay, I'm done. <laughs> I have an STD. So just RSVP or? Yeah, the number's right on there. Great.